I'm here on Saddle Peak. These face of Saddle Peak about, I don't know, 7,500 feet off the ridge. Dug a snow pit here. There's about a little over four feet of snow on the ground. Isolated a column and we got it to propagate across um, at an ECTP 22. So after 22 hits, snapped right across. Which is right here, which is most of the most of the column. It's the, the, the bottom foot and a half, two feet is like sand. It's it's really junky, big, faceted, kind of depth core crystals. Right now, it seems like it's the snowpack has definitely been adjusting to the little load that it has been getting. Um, but I anticipate if we got a rather large storm, we could see this breaking easily, and when it breaks, it could break at the ground. If we get a lot of smaller storms, maybe we'll get lucky, and it'll be able to adjust to the load. But looking at the snow structure, it's really bad. We've got loose kind of junky, depth poor, not strong snow, trying to hold up whatever comes in. So we're gonna be paying close attention to this and how the storms come in, how much snow falls is gonna be really crucial as to whether or not this thing slides.